So tell me, uh, so what happened? Yeah, so um, like you say, mindset, right? Yep. I, I, it, it was when, when I first started, so I went through, I knew the information. Um, I was very, you know, I'm familiar with it. I'm good, right? Right. I go out and I target a few companies and I get absolutely nothing, you know? And I, I, I'm like completely lost on it. Like, how can these people not even respond to email or anything because the, you know it's such a great deal i mean if you're, you're you're in business it would only make sense if you were to work with the federal government especially if you had the capacity and you you know you could do it so i i, I couldn't get past it so i uh, came out to miami you know we had the conversation i spoke with you and then you know uh um, talk ray I talked to ray and it was like a light switch went off you know it, it I, I started to look at things differently. You know, I changed my attitude about it. And another thing that um, that helped, uh, I don't know if you remember this, but we were talking and I asked you, like, you know, what, what, what does that customer look like? Because in hindsight, I had a poor attitude going into it. And on top of that, I really didn't have a target customer. I didn't know who I was looking for. Uh... So, okay. you know, I'm, I'm out and I'm, I'm going out talking to companies, but I'm like in the wrong, you know, I'm in the wrong league, you know, so these companies that I was talking to, they weren't my customers. So okay, see. now let me ask you this. What is your background, actual background? Background uh, Intel. So I was in the okay. Naval Intelligence. Okay, okay. And then you said you had the wrong customer. Like, you, so you were talking to anybody, everybody. Right, right. You know, I, I, I didn't have a target customer. You know, and it's like we go through and we build a target market list and, you know, it's not clicking. You know, none of this, I'm not thinking, I don't know what was happening, but I never thought to sit down and define my customer. Who, who am I looking for? Who, was, who am I going after? You know, right. and once I did that and changed my attitude, wow. Yeah, okay, so now it changed your attitude. So then what happens next? <laughs> <laughs> by the so way listen, my... <laughs> just listen just so you guys know i didn't bring regis on here for nothing okay <laughs> so you know this is a good story right i didn't just bring a random person on here arbitrarily <laughs> so this is this has got to be a good story right so hang on hang on i'm hanging on go ahead regis okay so uh leave miami you know i'm i'm excited you know i've, I've got i'm I got my energy back i'm going out i find a specific customer, you know, um, I'm looking for customers in the million plus range. And I started calling people, sending out flyers and the return, you know, people were coming in, calling, responding so fast that I like had to step back and like look at the situation like, whoa, you know, I'm getting too much traffic now. I can't really handle, I can't process it all. And, you know, there was some large, uh, you know, some large customers. One of the, one of the, um, the clients that I was talking to, well, I'm still talking to them now, they, they do, uh, what, 900 million a year. The other uh, companies in construction, they do about 3 million. 